Thank you for coming back for day three of the short readings from Carmen's Legacy. And all of these, I'm hoping, are empowering people to be the safest road users you can possibly be. This is the preface. At age 42, I was involved in a car crash that tragically took the life of an 18-year-old girl and threw my life and my family's lives into utter chaos. My injuries were significant and they would change my life forever. Thankfully, I was not at fault in that car crash. This was just the beginning of a horrific series of events for my family. 30 months later, Carmen, our sweet, gorgeous, hilarious and vivacious youngest daughter, fell asleep at the wheel of her car. She hit a tree and died instantly. Carmen was 18 years and three months. These two heartbreakingly tragic events could have torn our family apart. Instead, we became even stronger. As for me, I found my strength and my purpose in life. With our lives shattered and wanting to make sense of what happened to our family, Carmen's tragic death gave me the power to change the lives of others. In the wake of losing Carmen, our beautiful youngest daughter in that car crash, I embarked on a road safety campaign that has since impacted, and I believe, saved the lives of thousands of people over the past 24 years. My purpose is to share my family's story and Carmen's story. I hope it spares at least one other family from having to experience our devastation. In doing so, the life or lives, I might save, are Carmen's legacy. To the best of my ability, this book recounts the happenings that shaped my journey, my family's journey, and most importantly, honours our beautiful daughter Carmen. It also highlights that even in your darkest hour, you can triumph over tragedy with the love and support of family. Thank you, and I look forward to bringing you more of Carmen's legacy tomorrow.